This week's Power 25 high school football rankings are presented by Powerade, and we got a couple of new teams joining. Katie went from unranked all the way to number 12 after beating the defending 6A Division I Texas State champs North Shore to open the 2019 season. The Tigers outscored the Mustangs 17-0 in the second half and won 24-21. Dutch Fork transfer Ron Hoff had a monster night rushing for 219 yards and a score. 2021 quarterback Bronson McClellan and Jordan Patrick were a big time connection on offense and the defense was lights out the entire second half. The loss dropped North Shore from 4-17 to and the only other new team to join the Power 25 rankings presented by Powerade was Hoover. The Alabama Power has reeled off two big time wins to start the 2019 campaign beating Central Phoenix City and Coco in back to back weeks and they check in at number 23. Now looking at the rest of the top 25, St. John's and IMG Academy both moved up a spot after North Shore's loss to 4-5. and five. St. Louis Lewis moved up a couple of spots after beating Bishop Gorman 31-19 to number 8. The defending 7A state champs Lakeland slides into the top 10 at number 9. The two biggest movers this week were Marietta and Northwestern. Marietta improved to 2-0 after beating Philly Power St. Joseph's Prep 24-21 and moved from 17 to 10. 2020 Tennessee commit Harrison Bailey led them on a game-winning drive late in the fourth quarter and found 2020 Michigan State commit Ricky White from 23 yards out with 14 seconds left to clinch the win. The loss dropped St. Joseph's Prep from 8 to 18 and things don't get any easier this week for them because they play number 4 St. John's. The back-to-back Florida 6A state champs Northwestern posted its second consecutive shutout beating Carroll City 10 to nothing and went from 25 to 15 in this week's Power 25 presented by Powerade. You could make a strong case Max Edwards squad has the best defense in the state. They're loaded with a bunch of big time players led by Terrence T2 Lewis and Cameron Kitchens. Up next for the Bulls is number 5 IMG Academy and the loss for Carroll City dropped them from 16 to 25 and they get Miami Central next who is the first team outside of the top 25 at number 26. Number 1 Modern Day rolled to a 63-7 win over Via Park. 2020 USC commit Bryce Young accounted for 5 touchdowns and up next for the Monarchs is a road game in Arizona against the back-to-back 5A state champ Centennial. Another week and another dominant performance for number 2 St. Francis Academy. They shut out Sydney and 55 nothing and have outscored the opposition 104 to 13 through its first two games. Number three, St. John Bosco rolled again this week and beat Don Bosco Prep 56-21. 2020 Clemson commit DJ Uyunglele threw for 250 yards and six touchdowns. And 2020 Oregon commit Chris Hudson finished the night with 153 yards receiving and three scores. The Braves hit the road to Vegas to play against Liberty in the Polynesian Classic on Friday night. Gonzaga moved up a couple of spots from 13 to 11 after cruising to a 33-14 dub over American Heritage and five-star quarterback Caleb Williams had a huge night accounting for four touchdowns. The defending WCAC champs get Don Bosco Prep next. New Jersey Power St. Joseph Regional moved up in this week's Power 25 rankings presented by Powerade from 21 to 16 after beating a very good J. Sarah Catholic team in the honorable 24-13. And the last thing on the menu is the next five group. Miami Central checks in at 26. John Curtis Christian is up next at 27, followed by Mentor, who knocked off the defending Division I state champ St. Edward to open the 2019 season. Colquitt County checks in at 29, and Cathedral Catholic takes a big jump to number 30 after beating a very talented Saguaro team 18-10 in the Honor Bowl this past weekend.